guys, welcome back to Simply Jane's channel. We're on our way to San Antonio. Do you know the way to San Antonio? was a street sweeper. He just told me, go straight ahead, ma'am. It was a wonderful walk. I was like strolling in a park. Look how beautiful San Antonio de Padua Church is here at Forbes Park. Wow, this is such a beautiful place. Do you know that this is the subdivision of the elite, the prominent families, the old rich of Makati? Well, we're not here for them. We're here actually to visit the church. I bet this is another Baroque church, but it's well finished and it's painted white and beige. Beautiful. How old could this church be? I was trying to look for the marker or historical marker, but I couldn't find one. Maybe it's inside. The marker outside says equestrian order of the Holy Sepulchre of Jerusalem. The equestrian order of the Holy Sepulchre of Jerusalem is a Catholic order of knighthood under the protection of the Holy See. The Pope is the sovereign of the order. Its principal mission is to reinforce the practices of Christian life by its members in absolute fidelity to the Pope, to sustain and assist the religious, spiritual, charitable, and social works, and the Christians in the Holy Land, particularly of the Latin Patriarchate of Jerusalem. In 1342, Pope Clement VI, by the papal bulls Gratiam Agimus and Nuper Carissime, declared the Franciscans as the official custodians of the holy places in the name of the Catholic Church. So, this church must be administered by the Franciscans. But it is under construction. There's a renovation going on. More like a serious retrofitting of the building. I'm sorry guys, there's no way of approaching the altar right now. So anyway, we can come back some other time. This is a beautiful church and I'm sure after the renovation, this will be even more beautiful. So I went out and I found a Franciscan priest trying to give Holy Communion. But I said, Father, I haven't gone to Mass. And in fact, I wanted to go to confession. I haven't had a chance to go to confession since the pandemic began. Very promptly, the good priest offered me the sacrament of reconciliation. What a miracle! Amazing grace! I was lost, but now I'm found. Look at Saint Anthony of Padua, patron saint of lost souls, lost persons, lost items, and even of the elderly. Did you know that this is a century-old statue of St. Anthony de Padua, a survivor from the patio of the original San Francisco Church in Intramuros? All buildings, with the exception of San Agustin Church, were raised to the ground during the Japanese bombings of 1945. The Franciscans arrived in Manila on July 2, 1577. Upon their arrival, the first 15 friars were temporarily housed in the Augustinian convent in Intramuros. Even the Augustinian recollects stayed there. 
What history? On another occasion, this place must be a very good venue for a recollection or a retreat. But definitely not today because so many workmen are busy at work. Since I entered through the exit gate, I did not find this signage. It says here, makeover in progress. I can't thank God enough for directing my steps to San Antonio. so much guys for accompanying me in this pilgrimage to San Antonio de Padua Church, 3117 McKinley Road, Forest Park, Makati City, Philippines. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please comment down below for questions or suggestions. Simply chain uploads a new video almost every day please watch out for our premiere at 5 in the afternoon thank you for watching god bless you